What is up everybody, Miss Infinity here, and hello to all of you new subscribers. I haven't said hi yet, I'm sorry. Um, so, hi, welcome, thank you for subscribing, I appreciate it. Um, so, in case you guys haven't noticed, I'm sure most of you have by now, but um, my mental health has not been the greatest lately, at all. So, that is why I've been failing to record and upload, and I apologize. Um, yeah, I've been in a pretty bad rut lately. Um, my anxiety is, like, sky high, because I don't know if I've mentioned this or not yet. I'm not sure. But, well, um, so you know, guys, that I am disabled. I have quite a few health problems, and, uh, I can't work. My doctors literally told me that I can't. So, that's awesome. But I haven't been able to work in the past several years now. So, I've been fighting for disability since 2015. And that's just, well, since I moved to Tennessee, I've been fighting a little bit longer than that. Because, uh... I applied once or twice in Illinois, too, and got told no. Um, they have some pretty high requirements, and it's understandable, but weird. Um, like, two of my illnesses are at the top of the list. So, technically, they weren't supposed to be allowed to deny me, but they did anyway. So, this time, this is the third time now, third or fourth time, that I've applied for disability in Tennessee. And, um, this time, when they denied me, I decided to appeal it and went through a lawyer. So, that whole process is almost done. Finally. Um, my disability hearing is next month. So, I have been getting anxious and depressed and stressed out and worried. This whole situation has given me like friggin' 10 anxiety attacks. It's been horrible. Uh, so that is why I have not been recording and uploading and I apologize. Um, but sometimes you, your mental health really needs to you know, take priority over certain things. So I apologize, but I am trying my best to take care of myself. Um, and it's not always easy, especially when you have a toddler running around. <laughs> so that whole situation, that that's super fun stuff. But my hearing is finally set for next month. Um, so I'm kind of panicky about that the closer that it gets. Um, I don't do well in courtrooms. Um, I've been through several of them now, um, with custody cases with my dad and custody cases with Maddie's dad and then custody slash divorce cases with my mom's ex-husband and Maddie's adopted dad. Um, Oh, let me tell you, we do not call him that. We don't like him. Terrible human being. But, uh, yeah, so. And then several cases that I went to for my aunt. And then a few cases that I went to for, like, minor things. Like, speeding tickets and stuff for my mom. Um, not many of those, though. No. But, uh, and then I got a speeding ticket, um, back when I worked at Spencer's. And, uh, so yeah, I went to the court for that to get that all figured out and situated. Um, but I don't do well in courtrooms. They make me anxious. I don't like them. So, uh, that's kind of getting to me too. So we'll see. Um, I apologize for looking so dang raggedy right now. Um, 
I'm sure you can hear it in my voice and see it in my eyes. I am incredibly tired. It is like... Uh, 10.30 in the morning. And usually that's great. Usually I get enough sleep, I was all good. But yesterday we decided to treat ourselves a little bit. And uh, we went to the fair because it was the last day. And uh, so their wristbands were a little bit cheaper. So we went to ride a couple of rides, have some fun, because we haven't really gotten to go out and have fun in a while. So we did that, and then we went to the bar, because we have not been to the bar in what feels like a century. It's been so long. And, uh, like, when we got there, I got hugged by, like, four different people. Like, oh my god, you guys are here. Like, yes. We would come more, but kind of hard to do when you have a two-year-old. No. Um, again, I'm sorry I keep looking this way. Um, camera lens over here. Rest of phone over here. And I get distracted seeing the movement on the screen from me. Yeah, my brain's like that. Anyway, so I apologize that I keep looking over. I'm trying to do better. I'm, I'm trying. I'm just not good at it. Um, but yeah, so I guess a little bit of catch up updates since I last recorded. Um, Ethan is doing wonderfully. His doctor said that he is very advanced for his age, which I mean, I kind of knew, but Still, makes me pretty proud. He is pretty much exactly where he needs to be on all of the growth scales. Um, so that's really cool. And, uh, he's learning new words every day. It's insane. Um, I go over little home lessons with him every day. And then I subtly teach him when we're playing or watching something or whatever we're doing. Um, so he has learned manners very well. Um, he still gets a little bit mixed up when he's the one doing something nice and someone says thank you. He'll say thank you. Um, and then sometimes he'll hand me something and say thank you. You're welcome. I'm like, at least you have manners. Good on that. <laughs> So he's doing very well with, you know, please, thank you, you're welcome. Um, he has also discovered the joys of Sesame Street. He absolutely loves Elmo. He loves Elmo. He also likes Cookie Monster. He's not sure about most of the rest of them. Um, Big Bird he likes. He likes Big Bird. But his favorite, by far, is Elmo. Um... So that, that's nice. And that's something that I could watch all day. I used to watch Sesame Street as a kid all the time. Sesame Street and Elmo's World, I loved them. Uh, so he's started watching them and that makes me happy. I was getting a little bit tired of watching Paw Patrol and Peppa Pig all the time. They get annoying. <laughs> like, don't get me wrong, they're cute and everything, but I'm pretty sure I've seen every single episode now. And I'm pretty sure I've seen most of them like 10 times. So it gets annoying. Um, but so he has discovered the joys of Sesame Street and Elmo's world. And uh, so I'm kind of working into the, I guess, more educational parts of it. Um, he's learned quite a few things from it. And that's cool. Um, However, we haven't seen any of the episodes with the Count, and that's what I'm waiting for, because the Count always made me giggle, at least as far back as I can remember. I don't know. My mom could tell you more, but at least as far back as I remember, I've always loved the Count. Uh, I mean, A, I like vampires. B, he's called the Count. <laughs> and C, he's called the Count because Count Dracula, and he counts. He's great. <laughs> um... And then it, every time he says a number, he says, ah, ah, ah. And it, it, I don't know. It, it makes me smile. So, 
there's that. But, um, so Ethan is doing very well. Um, we are, we are rather proud of him. We are very proud of him. Um, Michael is also doing well. He hit his one year anniversary at his job. So that's really cool. Um, most of his coworkers are more like family than coworkers. So that, that's really nice. It's great to see him working somewhere that he's happy. That's really nice. Um, yeah, my life's not that interesting. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, so our cats are getting pretty big now. Um, like, they're still adolescents, and you can tell looking at them, but they're getting bigger, and they are excellent hunters now. Especially Nova. Nova is a great hunter. It's wonderful. And they're learning how to climb trees, which is scary. I'm waiting for the day that someone tells me, your cat's stuck in a damn tree, and then I'll have to go outside and attempt to climb. We don't have any very good climbing trees. Which is sad. I used to climb trees all the time. But, um... I'm kind of not supposed to now. That sucks. But, anyway, I'm sorry for all the, like, long, awkward pauses. Um, I literally just woke up, like, 20 minutes ago. I was supposed to wake up to take my meds at 7, but I slept through both of my alarms. Oops. But that's okay, I am home alone. Um, Ethan is with his Gigi, and Michael is at work. So, I'm alone, which is good, because I overdid myself a little bit yesterday. So, um, I, I need the recovery time. But we, uh, we went to the fair, and we rode several rides, and it was great. Uh, I missed it miss it a lot. I love fairs and carnivals and amusement parks. They're great. They're some of my favorite things. Um, so I, I kind of overdid myself a little bit. And then to stack on top of it, we went to the bar afterward. And I only had a couple of drinks, like little ones that Humboldt can't serve liquor. So I didn't have any liquor. So I had two, um, Jack Daniels makes, like, wine cooler type things, and I had two of those. Um, so not, not very strong at all, but Michael really wanted a drink, so I'm like, chances are he's gonna get too messed up to drive. I'll, I'll need to drive home. So I'm like, nope, I don't need more than that, I'm fine. Um, so that, that was fun. I looked hella good yesterday. Just saying. I thought I looked pretty great. Uh, <laughs> so that, that, that was, it was fun. It was fun. Um, I'm trying to think of, like, anything else to say right now. I am so tired. Um, but my body feels like death. <laughs> I feel like a flaming pile of trash right now. Um, I still smell nice, no? I smell like fair food and perfume. Sad thing is I didn't even get any fair food. I should have because around one-ish in the morning, um, we meant to leave the bar by like 11, 11.30 to be home by midnight so that Michael got half decent sleep before work. We failed. <laughs> we didn't leave the bar until a bit after one, um, but around 12.40, 1 o'clock, uh, I started feeling super off, which is normal, um, for when I don't take my medicine on time. Usually if I'm off by an hour or two taking my meds, my body starts feeling really off. I start getting, like, nauseous, and it's no fun. So I was starting to get nauseous and feel really off, and I'm like, why? What is wrong with me? I don't usually start feeling like this till around 1. Look down at my phone, I'm like, oh, it's 12.45. Okay. <laughs> and then uh, we went to leave, and they do karaoke. 
and it's not like a super big bar so there are only so many people on the list right but um moms the owner of the bar always makes michael and i get up and sing every time so when we win when we were going to leave bam michael gets called up next and i'm like all right well guess we guess we're gonna do this and then head out so we didn't leave the bar until like 1 10 1 15 somewhere around there and then michael's drunk self wanted to go to the store and get snacks so we did that um which was probably a good thing because i hadn't eaten since three or four and that's that's no bueno okay no no good don't do that huh <laughs> I used to be able to go like all day without eating and never be worried about it. But now, um, yeah, no, I can't. I have to eat at least semi regularly. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Anyway, to avoid any more awkwardly long pauses and the ums and the uhs and all of that fun stuff, I am going to cut the video here. Um,. See, there I go again. <laughs> I have a bad habit of that. But I'm going to leave this video here. And I will, as long as mentally I'm doing alright, if I'm having any physical problems, I'll still record. That's fine. But uh, depending on my mental state, I will see you guys next week. Don't forget to like and share and comment and subscribe and ring the little bell thing. There are like 50 things you can do now. I don't know. But do all that fun stuff if you like. That'd be nice. It makes me feel really good. Actually helps me get over my social anxiety a lot. So that's cool. But yeah. So I will see you guys next week. If you have any comments, thoughts, suggestions... Any videos that you would like to see us do, or see me do, or see all of us do, whatever. Have any ideas, have any wants, likes, needs, desires, whatever. Comment down below, let me know. And I will do my best to make you happy. So, see you next week everybody. Bye!